welcome back to my channel everybody and if you are new here i'm chantel i post weekly makeup videos and travel videos so let's get into this look it's a get ready with me and now we've moisturized our lips we put our moisturizer on our face and patting that in now i'm gonna prime with my fenty beauty primer it almost finished so now we're just rubbing that in well patting it in time to hydrate all right so now i'm going to into with the eyeshadow and i'm just buffing that out i have eyeshadow tutorials here on my channel so if you're not familiar with this you can always watch one of my eyeshadow tutorials just to learn how to blend your eyeshadow better if you're like just beginning um, makeup beginning um, starting out into makeup you can just watch those videos to you know help yourself out a bit all right so now we're um using mascara now i'm going to color correct <laughs> So the color, um, the concealer palette that I'm using is called Makeup from a brand called Makeup Atelier. You can get this on, um, I think it was Lady Moss Beauty. I got it from. I'm not sure, but one of those um makeup professional sites, professional makeup supplies. I got it from. So yeah, I look a bit crazy with the orange. So I just blended that out because of the hyperpigmentation, and then I went in with my regular concealer just to bring back the color that I need because I don't want to look too orange. So if you have dark circles under your eyes, you can always use a color corrector and then go on top of it with your regular concealer and blend it out properly. So that's basically what I'm doing here with my blending sponge just to blend it out seamlessly and that I don't look, you know, too crazy. Now I'm taking a foundation which is a bit dark. And um, it didn't even look dark while I was on camera or while I was actually doing it because I had the ring lights on and the sunlight coming in. So it didn't look so dark. But now sitting and watching it, I was like, okay, well, yeah, this is really dark. <laughs> so anyways, going back with the concealer again, just to brighten because, you know, we did the orange. So we need to brighten that up. So I'm setting with the Sasha Buttercup setting powder. So anywhere you apply liquid, you need to set it with powder so it doesn't crease and so it doesn't get cakey and you don't look crazy. All right. So this is one of the best setting powder. I absolutely love it because it brightens your under eye. It doesn't uh, make you cakey and you don't look like a ghost when you use it. So if you're dark skin, you can get this. Now moving into lashes, I'm applying my favorite lashes. I used to sell lashes. I think I mentioned it. So those are mink lashes then i'm using my contour palette which is the anastasia beverly hills contour palette this is in the shade dark then i'm gonna contour all around my face you know the cheekbones and those a couple places then moving on to the under eyes i'm going to take that same contour contour powder to just apply it under my under eyes because anywhere you put eyeshadow like the eyeshadow that you put on top you like to use the same mattifying shadows though on the eyes moving into blush i'm taking this very old estee lauder brush um cheek palette that i have so so the blushes in there are very beautiful i mean i definitely love this this gives you a rosy look so if you want a nice rosy look here you get this now i'm hydrating drinking some water and boy that day was very hot so yeah and if you notice my name is on the cup so i like that cute little tumbler <laughs> all right moving along i'm contouring my nose so my nose is really big and i am aware of that so i like to contour my nose make it look slim but it's never usually to the point of how i want it to be contoured but it's getting there all right so you know we just contour both sides and blend that oh you don't want to see two lines on your nose anytime you do contour it must be blended out then i'm gonna take this other palette so it's a i'm using the highlighter in the palette another rose tone highlighter yeah so that's what we're doing here and uh, we're just blending out the highlighter with a brush after that we're going to set our face with our fenty beauty powder so have definitely have a love hate relationship with this powder and the shade i'm using is 420 so if you're same skin tone as me you can try this shade out um it gives good coverage however the the powder tends to make me look a bit oily after certain times throughout the day so i normally have to like you know um blot 
all right so i'm just setting everywhere on my face with it so i get um additional coverage because the foundation that i used earlier was more of a low coverage um foundation light coverage foundation sorry <laughs> so yeah i'm just patting in the fenty beauty powder it's very full coverage it's mattifying well to an extent we can't justify that part as yet so now i'm just lining my lips with this beautiful lip liner that i got from the beauty supply store so it's more of a hmm i don't even know how to call this but it's more on the rosy side and i really like it so it's very cute and um sometimes you don't want to do nude liners or a nude lip because that's been a trend for quite some time so i have to switch it up sometime and go back to colors so yeah colors we are doing today now we're moving on to this makeup by mario palette and i've been using it from time to time and i'm taking this very pretty light pink shade and i'm blending it in with the lip liner because we're going for a rosy pink look today but not too rosy we're keeping it um nice and cute so it's clean girl makeup then we're going in with this um black radiance lip gloss i mean this lip gloss is really nice it smells good it smells like something i can eat it smells like strawberry now the look is finished and we're going to moisturize the body so i'm taking my bath and body works into the night body cream rubbing that into my palms and then moisturize my hands and everywhere else that needs to be moisturized now i'm taking my jimmy Choo perfume but i forgot the name right now but yeah if you have this you know what i'm talking about it smells amazing when i say amazing amazing so yeah i'm just rubbing that into my hands and then put um my neck all of my clothes etc and that's the look i'm liking how it turned out it's very cute and yeah like i could go somewhere and unfortunately i went nowhere <laughs> So that's the look guys and um, I hope you enjoyed it so don't forget to like, comment in the comment section, subscribe to my channel, like any little thing. So thanks for watching and I'll catch you in the next one. Bye!